Hello guys, welcome back to another video. It's just on here, and I'm going to be speaking to you about Gary's Mod Servers today. And I'm going to be teaching you how to install the admin administration mod onto your Gary's Mod server. Now, basically, this admin mod is called Ulex or Ulib. Basically, it's a very, very popular administration mod found on basically every server out there. Every server basically requires it for ranks, kicking, banning, all that stuff. But of course, if you own a dark RP server, it comes with, it already comes, that game all comes with a administration mod called F admin, but ULX is much more secure and safer. So let's hurry up and hop into how to install ULX. So first, what you're gonna wanna do is go to your direct browser. Okay, it's mine is Google Chrome, because I'm smart. Go to Google, you're gonna search ULX and ULib. Click on the first link that shows up, which the link will be down in the description. You're going to see, put in full screen here, you see stable releases. You don't want to go with stable because it's much safer and easier. But of course, if you want to go with the beta, go ahead. Now, as you see, it says zip files here. So what we're going to do, we're going to find the first and most stable, which we have we're first going to need to install ULIB. Keep in mind, all this is installation is very easy. So I'll also direct you to the link, this link in the description. I'll give you links to all of these. So once you download it, just drag it to your desktop. And extract. After that, you're going to have to direct your server files here. Gary's mod add-ons. Take your ULIB folder, which as you see has all the Lua, all that, and you're going to drag it in. Once you have done that, you have successfully installed ULIB. What you're going to do is then download the ULX 3.6.2.zip. Drag it to your desktop, it's right there, and then drag the main folder inside that zip file inside your add-ons, where the ULIB is. Right after that, all you gotta do, I suggest keep your folder open, is restart your server or start up your server. I'm gonna restart it. I see it's running, everything's okay. It's if you see it's working, your command line changer should show all this. Not this, because this is just a custom add-on I made for my server. Should be good. So what we're gonna do. As you see, my Gary's mod is down here. So we're going to reconnect to my Gary's mod server. It's going to connect quickly because this is a fresh server built for basically this. Now, first thing you're going to see is the ULX MOTD, which this is a derma, basically. So, once you see that, you're just going to close out of that. And you know, everything's working fine. Mine is a TTTK mod. So what you're gonna do is open up menu. As you see, I have opened up the ULX menu. Basically, this is where you're gonna go when you wanna ban people, mute people. That's where you have everything. It even shows the server time. You can talk to people, do all the stuff. So for example, help, shows this help. I haven't set any of this up considering you just saw I just installed this um, and there's no users so there's basically no setup except for what I just showed except if you want if you install custom ULX commands which I'll have links in the description there's some cool custom ULX commands that I see it and use so yeah now we're gonna get into one more thing is giving yourself super admin which is basically the owner rank on the ULX administration system what we're going to do, in your server, you have something called an Archon Password. If you do not, what you're going to do to get this Archon Password, go to your server directory, go to CFG, server.cfg, right click, edit remote path plus plus. As you see, this is all my server files. Now, on my server, I have this due to I added this in, which is much easier to work with. 
Now, see this Archon password? If you do not set, have this set up, go to add Archon underscore password space type in or whatever you want to have your Archon password as. Once you have that, you see Jonathan Grant here. That's my Archon password. We're going to go here, back into our game. Open up the console, type in Archon underscore password Jonathan Grant. And to see if that password is correct, okay, didn't work. So basically, um, hmm, I don't. This, uh, this is a locally hosted server. What you're gonna do after you type in your correct Archon password, add user. Oh, sorry. Gonna type in Archon Ulex add user. Type in your name, which in this case my name is Dead. Lee is spread. And if it gives you this error, this is how you're going to be given the way to add ranks. If it gives you this error on your server, open up your uh, administration or you, your hosting little system here, and you're going to type in ULX add user dead Lee super admin which if your locally hosted server your server is very safe considering it is ran through locally hosted and people cannot get into your server if they're not used with the same um I don't know how to call it uh IP see everything's good now if we open up the menu now we got all these new commands which is ban ban id help kick all that for example, I kick myself, but I'm not going to do that because I'm staying. Now, there's, to make, I'm going to go over stuff in a later episode of setting up ULX. For example, ranks, settings, all that stuff. I'll go to a later episode how to set that up. So I hope you guys enjoy this episode on how to install ULX. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, comment any future episodes you want me to do on server developing. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out.